I'm joined by Tommy Williams after this afternoon's 1-0 draw against Farnborough. Tommy, was that as frustrating from the sidelines as it was from behind the goal? Yeah, it was frustrating, certainly. Um, but I didn't think we were nowhere near our standards that we've set of late. And I don't think we had enough movement off the ball today, certainly first off. Um, so, yeah, I mean, we, we turned the screw a bit, certainly um, last 25 minutes. Um, but couldn't, couldn't break them down and we, um, in the end I mean for all their hard work and effort Farnborough um, they probably deserve a replay. At 1-0 up were you disappointed that we didn't go on to, to increase our lead at that point especially against 10 men? S certainly I think it was, a, it was a great start for us um, I thought it was a sending off um, you know he, he's through on goal saps there and you know he's picked himself up took the penalty and then literally two minutes later he's he's feeling his hamstring so we've had you know Dan Sweeney break down in the warm-up as well which didn't help we've got Pico Gomez sitting in the stand with an injury and Peter Dean with an injury you know so they're four key players four experienced players that you'd want to have in your in your lineup so that, that wasn't a great um, start in terms of injury wise so um, yeah disappointed today. Um, and how much of a physical presence did we miss up front against quite a, an inexperienced, young-looking Farnborough team? Someone like Sweeney, Sappleton, in those last 10, 20 minutes, someone to throw the ball into the box at. How much did we miss them? Yeah, I, I, it was in my talk today, you know, about uh, you know being a little bit physically stronger um, and making that count. So, yeah, it was disappointing losing Saps. You know, we, we brought two into the club this year in, in, in terms of a target man and uh, both are sitting in the, in the, in the stand. So difficult. And what's the prognosis on, on the front two and Peter Dean and Dan Sweeney as well? They're likely to be fit for Monday, any of them? Um, we, we see how we, we go. I mean, they've, they've got both had treatment. Um, uh, I don't think Pico will be fit. Um, so, you know, Saps is a major doubt now, but uh, possibly um, Peter Dean might be might be available. Farnborough played with 10 men for, for a long time today. At the end of the game, they, they visibly looked tired. Um, we're used to playing Saturday, playing Monday. Will that come into it Monday evening, do you think? Well, they, I mean, they're used to it a little bit. They, they play Monday nights, obviously, as well. So they're a young side, so, you know, maybe um, that might help them in terms of recovery. Um, but, you know, we we weren't at our best today. There were some under-par performances, um, you know, and we need to be better come Monday night. We certainly need to. Um, you know, people have chances of some people sitting out at the side you know waiting for their chance and when when they do get it you know they they, they don't serve up a, uh, a a good performance so you know i've said to them in there anyone who's who's got the shirt on on monday you know needs to take their chance and take their opportunity um and as a group we need to be better than we were today are you expecting a different outlook from the Farnborough side on Monday? Today it was very much backs against the wall, they're playing with 10 men, they had to play defensively. Are you expecting them to come out a bit more on Monday night? Yeah, I mean, they're the home side now. They're, they're, I'm sure you know they'll be a bit more offensive. Uh, so they will be with obviously 11, 11 players on the pitch. Um, so, um, you know, we need to um, recover well um, in terms of our, our physically, and we need to go there on Monday and um, we need to set play at the standard we've set of, of um, the last couple of games you know VCD I thought we were excellent certainly second half and you know we were, we were very flat today didn't have enough tempo about us um, and we wasted minutes on the football pitch um, like I say just last 25 minutes we turned the screw a bit and we got into key areas and, and didn't really take take the chances um, so um, you know if, if we if we know Monday play to a standard that we know we've set, um, I'm sure we um, can get a good opportunity getting ourselves in the next round of the Cup.